Ian Wright wants Mikel Arteta to give Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang a second chance after stripping him of the Arsenal captaincy. Arsenal boss Mikel Arteta has been told to quash his drama with Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang for the greater good of the dressing room by former Gunners striker Ian Wright. The hard-nosed Spaniard left his former captain out of the squad to face West Ham last night after stripping him of the armband following the forwards' latest disciplinary breach earlier this week. Arsenal confirmed via a statement that Aubameyang would no longer be the club's captain as Arteta looked to make an example of the Gabon international, who returned to North London a day late after travelling overseas to see his mother. Yet it's not the first time this year that Aubameyang has frustrated his manager after he turned up late for the North London derby with Tottenham back in March. He was consequently dropped, just as he was last night but right now believes Arteta needs to move on from the ordeal as opposed to holding a grudge against the 32-year-old, he's just not entertaining anything to do with Aubameyang and I totally understand when he says he just wants to concentrate on what happened today and he doesn't want to talk about it, Wright told Premier League Productions. But I don't think you can continue to avoid it, especially in the way that it has come about. At some stage you're going to have to quash it or talk about it, he's got the capability of killing it and saying, yeah, he's in the plans and he's an Arsenal player, and he didn't do it, I was hoping for something like that because what you want now is everything's done, Arsenal have won, they've played brilliantly, the boss has been vindicated for his decisions so just quash it so they can move on. It's going to be talked about again, they will mention it again for the next game. And then if he's not in the next game, so he can kill it, that's all I'm saying. Kill it, Arteta gave a cold interview on the matter to BT Sports' Des Kelly after the 2-0 victory against the Hammers, making it clear that he did not want to talk about it after such an impressive display from his youthful side.